Hey y'all, Vampire Dracool back again with another Kali Linux video. In today's video, we're going to show you how you can execute a sudo command when the system boots up. So if you have a command that you want to run every single time you turn on the machine, automatically follow along. We'll show you how to do it. In this instance, I want my VPN that we set up in our previous Kali Linux video, which you can find in the channel here. If you want to know how to basically manually set up and configure a WireGuard VPN to your VPN service that provides manual configuration, check out that video link in the description below now uh, to get it done it's really simple uh, we have to open up a terminal and we have to edit a file now this file doesn't actually exist from the start but when we uh, create create it it will or edit it it will create itself so sudo nano forward slash etc forward slash rc local hit enter it might ask you for your sudo password make sure you type that in and you should drop into the nano file editor program here. Uh, there shouldn't be anything in this file from the start, but we're gonna copy and paste a command in. Now this command will be in the description below, so you can copy and paste it in as well. And basically here's how this works. So anything in between this top line, the bin slash bash and the bottom line exit zero, any sudo command you put in here should execute when the system boots up. So in this case, like I said, I want to turn on my VPN every single time I launch this virtual machine. I don't want to have to do it manually. I just want it to be up. Okay. So that the command for that sudo wg slash quick up and in the name of my configuration file for the wire guard for my VPN service. So um, that's really it. We're going to hit control O. It's going to ask us to write the file name. We'll hit enter. Wrote three lines, so that means it successfully wrote it. And control X to exit. Now we have to do one other command. We have to give this file executable rights so it can execute um, or it won't work at all. So make sure you type in this one, sudo chmod plus X for executable, forward slash etc, forward slash rc local. There we go. That command successfully executed. Now let's reboot and see if the VPN is up by just checking the status of it once the machine turns on. So we'll execute the reboot now command. It'll go through its setup here. We want to load this up. Now if you if you look closely when this loads up there should be a, a top line here. Um, it should say something about the command that we ran or whatever command you guys um, are using. So you can see at the top there uh, IP link add it's actually doing its uh, it's, it's thing right there. So it's executing it. It's going through the connection to get on the VPN. It takes a little bit sometimes. There we go. All right, so we're back on the desktop. All right, we're in here. Let it load up. Okay, so we're loaded up here. Firefox wants to open, that's fine. Zoom in, zoom in, zoom in, so y'all can see. And uh, make sure that it is actually working. I wanna check the status of my VPN connection. It's gonna ask for my pseudo password, and boom! That's it, it's already up, it's running, it worked. So, that's how you basically run any pseudo command at startup is you edit that file as you saw here so if this helped you out and you liked the video please like it and also comment in the comment section below if it worked out for you also let me know what other pseudo commands you're using in uh, for this i'm kind of interested to see what you all are using this for and what kind of other commands you're running uh, at startup there uh, if you want to see more content like this i would really really appreciate you if you could subscribe to the channel and if you want to get notifications of when we go live, don't forget to ding that bell. Till next time, keep it real.